Hey, LVC. Jeremy here with an important announcement that we are going to regather at McKinney Hall on the 6th of June for our first in-person service in over a year. So as you know, we had been hoping to meet outside, but the places we were looking at fell through. And so we think we can meet in McKinney Hall back in our old place safely. So it's going to be a service with 100 people for one hour starting at 10 a.m., so the 6th of June, stay tuned for information in your inbox or on WhatsApp on how you can register. But these will be Pomoja services to start. Most likely we will do one once a month for about three months, and then we'll just see how things are going on the ground and decide after that how frequently we'll meet as a church in person. So they'll still be live streamed and recorded if you don't feel comfortable coming uh, or if we just can't fit enough people, that will be possible to watch it still. So we will be doing strict COVID protocols, including distancing, mask wearing, sanitizing, and all of that with no contact whatsoever. I'd love to hug all of you, but we're just going to have to still be careful. We want to be careful about not contributing to yet a fourth wave in Kenya. But as things stand now, we believe we can do this safely, and we're so excited to get together as a church with as many people as possible. So couple things. You sh- you must register. So when the registration comes, jump on that as quickly as you can. You'll need to register every single person in your household, not just yourself, uh, not just your household as a unit, but every single person. So please do check into that. If you have any questions, reach out to either office at lavingtonvineyard.org or connect at lavingtonvineyard.org. Let us know if you have any questions, but we look forward to seeing you. Uh, In the meantime, we're going to have some more virtual services. So in between our once a month in-person services, we will have different virtual options. So stay tuned to all of the communications will come out about that. But in whatever way we can be together, church, we look forward to seeing you and just seeing what God's going to do even during this difficult time. Love you, church. Bye-bye.